Cider time. Cider time. We found a new cute cider. It's adorable. That reached out to me and she thought was pretty awesome too. We got Wind Ridge Crafty Hopped Hard Apple Cider. It's got a cute little bunny with a hop in its mouth. And Get bunnies it? hops. Bunnies hop, 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 hop. Also, the hop. cap is adorable too. Yeah, it's got this cute little uh, fox. fox with a scarf. Lighting's not great, but you get the you get the gist of it. It's a very very cute label. I'm right into it. We're gonna go split these on this, so I don't drink up all of our ciders. First off, very light in color, very see through, like a normal cider. Not many on the I hazy cider. Yeah, I've never once seen a hazy cider. No, we did the one. Cider. The space, whatever. Oh, uh, yeah, the unfiltered grapefruit. Yeah, that was a hazy cider. They gotta be unfiltered or they're not gonna be hazy. But we got 5.5 ABV on Bunny Average. Hip Hop. Hip Hop, Hip Hip Hop. Very crisp, very clean, very dry. Light on carbonation. Slightly sweet. Pretty dry. Mm -hmm. Extremely crisp. Very yummy. Uh, but not as sweet as most since we are talking about it being hot, which mm -hmm. is going to cut back on any kind of sweetness in this beverage. It balances it real well. Uh, carbonation is low, but that goes across the board for the majority of ciders. Yeah. You're never going to find a cider that's super carbonated. It smells very... Fresh and like crisp. I don't want to say organic, but very natural. Yeah. Get a little bunny hop into you. This was pretty good. Yeah. I like it. Um, very easy to drink. I don't think it's as hopped as that Jack's hard hop. No, cider that thing was super hoppy. That one was a bit drier and a bit hoppier. This one's very light on the hops, but it's very nice. Very balanced. I'm still waiting for some like over the top triple hop cider. It's gonna happen one day. No, I think this is like on the just hint of hops. It's very cute, very sweet. It's good. Yeah. It's real good. This is a very good uh, earlier on the weekend day kind of drink, like pre lunch or lunch. Yep. Very light going yeah, anything. Yeah, it's pretty light. Um, it's really light. But light in a good way. Light in like a refreshing, crisp, enjoyable way. Yes. Not a like yearning for more way. It's just like, yeah. oh, this is this is light, delicate, and nice. You yeah. know, while being hot, which seems to be growing some popularity in the cider world, but not right. a whole lot. It's still not common. So I like it. The only reason we tend to do so many of these, because I think we're on, what, three hop ciders? Two or three? It's just because any opportunity I see when I buy it. Because it's cool, and I like them. She tends to like the hopped ones. If it's got hops in it, I'm going to like it way more. Mm -hmm. So it's an instant purchase for me every time. It's always just like, if I see hop cider, we haven't had it yet. I immediately just pick it up, regardless of what it looks like, who made it, whatever. I just want to try all of them. The waiting to find that actual hop, hoppy flavored Oof, one. Sorry. Windridge Crafty Hot Hard Apple Cider. Winsup Hills of Pennsylvania comes true farm crafted hard cider. Crisp apples and quality hops. Yeah. It's very crispy apples. Very crispy. Kind of has a yellow apple taste. I'm sure it's not, but that's what it tastes like to me. Very simple ingredients. It's apples, yeast, hops. There you go. Makes sense. I like it. That's perfect. That's that's how it should be. All right. Good job, Woodwind. Must buy, should buy, maybe buy, don't buy. Um. For the cider enthusiast, I'd say definitely like. I, it's a should. I like it. I enjoy it. I'm definitely gonna buy it again. It's one of those, if you like dryer, go for it. It's a should buy. It yeah. is nothing crazy. It's nothing exceptional. It's just a very clean, crisp, well-balanced cider. It's not overbearingly sweet. It's not overbearingly fruity. It tastes very natural. It doesn't taste like a lot of artificial flavorings and all that kind of thing. That's very common, unfortunately. 
Um, so the small ingredient list helps. But that. it does have a super cute bottle, which was kind of my sole purpose in buying it. I liked it. Mr. Little Bunny in a suit with a hop in his mouth. Like, that's... It's sold. <laughs> I mean, that would even be cool for a beer bottle, right? Yeah. So that, that was kind of the selling point. But it's a very good, mixed, borderline exceptional cider with all the qualities you're looking for in one. So... If you see it, which I've never seen this but once, and it was like dusty on the top shelf at the liquor store, uh, I don't know. I'm sure you might have a little struggle struggle finding it, but if you have had it or are wanting to have it or do have it, let us know what you think about it. And if you agree with us thinking it's pretty darn good, we'll see you next time. We've probably got another cider video coming up. Bye.